different kinds of spirits. Welcome, good day, and hello to Silent Time, the opportunity to think on what is really important in life. There are different kinds of spirits. One is alcoholic drinks and its effects. Now there is ghosts and evil spirits. And yet another one is the Holy Spirit. What would you say? What do you expect? The effect of the Holy Spirit? Does it make us strange that we are like drunk? Around the time of Pentecost, the believers were gathered together in a place. Acts 2 verses 1 to 12. There was a noise from the sky sounding like a wind blowing. And the people gathered together. There were Jews living in Jerusalem, gathered from all around the world, from many places. And they all heard the apostles speak in their own languages. Verse 12, amazed and confused, they kept asking each other, what does this mean? The disciples, they were filled with the Holy Spirit, so they were urged to share that joy that they had experienced. But then the mockery starts. The people ridicule them in sarcasm. Verse 13, others made fun of the believers, saying, these people are drunk. And Peter may have heard that, and he may answer that in a speech, drunk, we were drunk in the past from the spirit of this world, filled with selfishness, with aggression, with evil spirits, and maybe sometimes also with wine. But now it is different. It is something totally different. The Holy Spirit has come in our heart, and we are finally sober. The Holy Spirit makes us sober and understand how things really are, gives a deeper understanding. Now we recognize the living God. We understand the risk and the dangers we were in, that we would be condemned, that if God does not protect us, we will be harmed here in this life and later. We understand our evil hearts. We have become sober and recognize where is our salvation in the crucified Son of God, because he gives us forgiveness from sin and he gives us real peace with God a true life, eternal salvation. How about us nowadays? Do we still think that the Holy Spirit is something strange, that people are not down to the ground? It will show us the reality and make us sober, not drunk. And then also we can bloom. Then we can also be a blessing to others and shine and reflect the light of God. Lord, we thank you for all the great things that you give. We ask for forgiveness where we fill ourselves with evil spirits of this world, where we get drunk and do other evil things. Help us to be sober and to understand your truth, the good news, that you have brought. You already have won the victory on the cross. Pray that many people will understand and recognize you as the Lord. Praise be to you forever. Amen.